Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh to some of you and peace to the rest of you. Black heart assigning black in again asking you to hit that share button first then you can decide on the like or the subscribe button and uh, my reason for uh, recording this is that um, I need to add something on about the warrior class. And I've already specified where there is none but I also want to specify what it is that the black community would need. The black community would not really need a warrior class. In all honesty, um, the truth be told, when it comes to overwhelming brute force militaries are used, those soldiers become traumatized. So even the strength of the nation becomes its weakness. This happened with the Soviet Union. Um, and it was Afghanistan that drained them. Now, Afghanistan didn't necessarily win, but the Soviet Union died. It's just like uh, in the wild, when two bears fight and the bigger bear uh, kills the smaller bear in the fight, but then later the bigger bear dies of its wounds. Or well, the bigger bear just wins the fight and walks off, but then dies of its wounds. While the smaller bear survives crippled. It's hard to tell who won. They both lost. We don't need that. Now I'm gonna tell you what actually did survive in that case, and that was the KGB. Now they weren't necessarily, I mean the KGB was not necessarily um, the KGB anymore, but they survived in the form of uh, either gangs or special law enforcement within the former Soviet republics, whatever was the case, they survived. They, they lived. Some went into organized crime, others went into specialized law enforcement, whatever was the case. They didn't die off. They had skills they could take with them and they had supplies they could take with them elsewhere. We don't necessarily need what you might think is a warrior class, although it probably would come in handy. I mean, I guess if we didn't have it, we'd wind up meeting one. But what we would need is more like um, a secret assassin's um, class, really those who can carry out vengeful assassinations and get away with it, stealthily. Maybe even framing somebody white for it. That's what we would need. So we're not even aware of what it is that we have, we're not aware of, of that upon which we rely in the first place. We don't realize that what we rely on uh, is not even overwhelming brute force, at least not right now. It would take some stealth, special training. You would have to be able to take down people and make it look like nobody did it or someone else did it. Because see, we're not even, we're, they're not even coming in with overwhelming brute force all the time. They come in with a few race soldier cops. That's what they're coming in with. And even when you get black law enforcement and black judges, that's not enough to stop them. It takes someone to actually be able to kill the enemy and get away with it. I certainly don't know how to do it. Most of us don't. There may not be a way to, and that's why I have advocated for black people repatriation. If you stay in their context, if you stay in their system, they're going to kill you off or enslave you. That's it. The long run for black people is you go back to Jim Crow. If they can take you back to Jim Crow, they can take you back to slavery. And those are the only options they're going to offer you. Slavery or Jim Crow. Well, I'm sorry, it's more like slavery or death. Jim Crow was just a transition. So while you're talking about a warrior class, which is fine to have if you can have it, you fail to understand that what you really need is an assassin class or you need to get the hell out. You need to leave. And I can tell you now, they're already doing whatever the hell it takes to make sure that no assassin class develops. <laughs> because if you black, if you were black, antebellum, you couldn't go around killing white folks even in secret. Especially the ones who deserved it the most. You couldn't do it even in secret. If you were part of an antebellum uh, black slave population, you did good just to run away. 
just to flee. So you're going to have to come to understand that we're hyping up a class we don't even have and failing to realize that the class we actually do need is much more secretive and requires a skill that may be impossible to get because of the uniform we have to wear that we can't take off. I hope this has been a benefit. Stop letting them distract you. Assalamu alaikum.